Hi, my name is Ananya Sridhar. I'm a second year neuroscience major in UC Riverside. I'm here to present you my teapot. Um, the goal of this project was to apply the tools that I've learned in, for future projects. Um, so the first thing I did was creating the body. Um, I used the sketch tool and the loft tool to create the curved body. And then um, I used the <coughs> I used the open, and then I created the opening of the mouth um, using the fillet and the extrude. And then um, the next thing I did was creating the handle. Um, for the handle, I used the sweep tool and the offset plane. And um, the challenge was um, with using the was um, making sure the also planes were aligned and my sketches were also aligned. Um, for the spout, I used the rough tool, um, my thickened tool and the offset plane. Um, the difference um, between um, the spout and the um, and creating the body was um, I used the path tool for um, making to create the curved um the curved shape and yeah um for the teapot cover um i use the loft revolve um the shell and the extrude um some of the challenges in creating the cover um was um creating the base making sure that the teapot cover fits the opening and then um, here's the assembly of the teapot. Um, to piece the piece, to piece the cover and um, the um, the teapot itself, um, we use the boolean tool. So for the teapot cover, um, I use the boolean tool, and um, then we use the mating tool to piece both the cover and the teapot. And yeah, that's pretty much. Nice. Um, does anyone have any questions? I have a question. So how long did you learn and what kind of help did you get and who helped you with that? Um, well, Caitlin helped me um, during the project and um, it took me about, about I think like a month or, you know. About a month? Well, not a month. <laughs> okay. Five weeks or so. Yeah. yeah. So my name is Caitlin. I'm a mechanical engineering student at UCI. I'm the one that taught her all the tools that she used to make the teapot. I think we took about a month just learning the basic tools and looking at different examples about how to use them before putting them into the teapot example. And I think we took her about four classes just once a week to finally complete the whole teapot and have it printed out. What challenges did you have during this project? Um, well, some of the, well, it was like tiny challenges, like mainly making sure that like, we assemble it well and making sure that we have the right dimensions of the circles and also um, making sure that, um, yeah, it was like, yeah, the, those were like some of the challenges, but. What is your next project? Well, my well, my next project um, is mainly. Um, but, yeah, the main, yeah, the next project was, is do, doing Python. Um, that's my next project. Thank you. <laughs> awesome. Let's give a round of applause.